Hello there friends, welcome back to my channel. So today we're doing the neutral makeup with a little bit of a life on the eyes. So yeah, if you wanna see what this video is all about, please stay tuned. Firstly, off the camera, I have already moisturized my face and applied my Maybelline Baby Skin Pre-Primer. So now I'm covering my face with my MAC Studio Fix Foundation. This is so that I can achieve that matte finish and also to avoid using a whole lot of makeup on my face. And then now moving to my eyes, I'm going to use my LA Girl Nude Eyeshadow Palette. So the color I'll be using is it's actually more of a deep purple. However, on the video, it looks like it's gray. So yeah, but it's actually a deep purple. So I'm going to use it at the outer corner of my crease. And then I'm going to blend it towards the inner of my crease. And guys, I think we all know that well, whatever you do on the left, you must also do on the right. So I'm gonna do the exact thing I did on the other eye. And this time, I think it will be more visible than the other eye. Um, and guys, remember please to blend, blend, blend. It is so important to make sure that you softly and gently blend the colors. With a clean blending brush, I'm going to clean the top of my crease just to make sure that I don't have any excess shadow all over my eye. And then on my lids, I'm applying my MAC Antique Eyeshadow. This one is very close to my skin color. I think now I want to deepen the colors on the outer corner of my crease um, but then for that I will be using this um, gray eyeshadow and then I will be pulling it towards the inner and on top of my crease and then I will be blending it so that it doesn't leave any harsh lines I think I'm gonna go back again with my MAC Antique Eyeshadow. I actually want it to be the one that takes the center stage. So I will be pulling it a little bit high and blending. And I'm gonna do that on both my eyes. So now I will be lining my eyelids with the black um, liquid liner. This one, I have a love-hate relationship with it, especially when I have the permanent eyelashes on. So I just don't know how I actually get it right, but lately I have been getting it right. And then for defining my face, I'm using this Yardley bronzer all over my cheekbones. And then after that, I will use El Shima um, just on top of my cheekbones, just to give it a little bit of life. And I am intentionally going softer with the colors, mainly because I went, um, you know, very boldly on my eyes. <laughs> I am so all over so now coming to my favorite part the eyebrows I'm going to take my spoolie brush and just brush them out just so that I can see my way around them you know this is always very useful especially when it comes to filling and shaping the eyebrows I always do this guys I just never rub myself um, by not doing that and then um, for shaping I'm using the brown pencil and then I always start at the bottom um, and then from there I'm gonna go on top and then fill all the gaps with the same pencil and then later on with the same spoolie I will be brushing out um, right at the beginning of my eyebrows and also for filling the middle of my eyebrows using my angled brush I will be applying my eyebrow gel
just to spice up things a little bit i am going to use a completely different technique um for filling and also shaping this eye um but then at the bottom i still use a brown pencil but then filling and shaping the top part i'm using only gel and remember the angled brush And the final touch on my eyes, I'm gonna line my water lines with the brown pencil that I've been using. I'm gonna go very soft on this one because I don't wanna achieve this smoky looking eye. And then finally, for my lips, I'm gonna go very simple with my HD Coral Lipstick. Mainly because, remember, we went very strong on the eyes. So the face and the lips, we're going very natural. So yeah, and then, but lastly, I'm going to line it with my brown pencil because they blend very well together. So here's the final look guys, I am really happy with it. I like the attention that I put on my eyes. So if you want me to do other videos, please don't forget to leave the request below on the description box. I will definitely do the videos. And don't forget to press the subscription button below. Until we meet again, remember that I love you. Yeah.